Let's get right to it. Are machine learning engineers programmers? This is a tricky one to answer. I use SQL and Python all day. Doesn't that make me a programmer? Maybe, maybe not. If you've read my post, you might have picked up this little insight. I'm not a hardcore programmer. What I mean is that I don't use Python to author anything end-to-end -end from within Python. I only use Python in the core libraries to process data and build models. When you're a programmer, you write all the code, including all the algorithms from scratch. This is another one of those myths in this space. Machine learning engineers do not write anything from scratch. The only people authoring production-ready machine learning models from the ground up are called programmers. Most of them work on the Google TensorFlow team or similar teams. Let me say that again. No company is going to hire a machine learning engineer to author machine learning models from scratch. That's not your job. Now, if you want to see what a machine learning model looks like from scratch, I'll put a link down below in the comment section where I authored a linear regression model from scratch. I've been doing this for a long time now, and I can count the people on my right hand that could author machine learning models from scratch. I have a course on several platforms, LogicBot, Udemy, and Packet, on authoring machine learning models from scratch. Very few people make it past the first model. This requires a ton of programming skills most simply don't have. You'll see if you decide to read my post that math is the easy part. If you're a developer on the TensorFlow team, you aren't a machine learning engineer. You're a developer. You are writing the algorithms. Those new to this space have a hard time understanding this, and it is confusing. Let's look at an example. I'm going to import some data to work with. Here's how I might accomplish this. If I am a machine learning engineer, I'm going to use a library called Pandas. It's the gold standard in the real world for working with data inside Python. Notice what I'm doing. The first line of code imports or brings in all the functionality of the Pandas library. On line 2, I'm calling the read CSV function. This function is really several lines of code. Here's what the read CSV function looks like if I were to write it from scratch. If I had to write it from scratch every time, the code would be verbose and it would be a waste of time. Don't forget, as a machine learning engineer, you aren't getting paid to author models. You're getting paid to make predictions with data from the company you're working with. As a machine learning engineer, I call things on my data sets. I do the exact same thing for almost everything I do in machine learning. When I load data from modeling, I call pre-written functions. When I visualize the data, I call pre-written functions. When I cleanse my data, I call pre-written functions. Guess what? When I build my models, I call pre-written functions. Machine learning engineers, and certainly data scientists, do not author their own models. We apply what's already been authored to our data. That's what frameworks and libraries are for. This is what I mean when we say we aren't hardcore programmers. We don't write the code behind most of the functions we use. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And have a great day.